saying that and the topic that you want, I was going to ask you this a little bit later, but this is the perfect time. Uh, Cash App creator Bob Lee found dead in San Francisco. Uh, do you think there's some kind of conspiracy behind that? Or do you think, you know, that, that just is what it is? It <laughs> you created Cash App. You ain't even got to Google his net worth. What you think his net worth was? It was in the billions. It was in the billions. Mm -hmm. If you was a billionaire, would you be um, in the streets of San Francisco? 2.30 in the morning. At 2.30 in the morning? <laughs> no, indeed not. With billions of dollars? No. I would bill me whatever the sent. Whatever street he was on, I bill it in a, in, a, in a dorm that I built for myself to recreate. I'm not going to be out and about with... You see what I mean? Real talk, real talk, real talk. <laughs> and I don't think that he was. I don't think that went down like that. Yeah, yeah. You see what I'm saying? That's kind of crazy, bro. Make it make sense. It, it, I, there's no way possible I can make that make sense. Make it make sense. Now, just make it seem like, let's look at it like this. Let's say there's this movie, a movie, mm -hmm. about a guy that created some type of banking system that you can use on a mobile app. That has never been done before, and when he creates it, it becomes one of the leading ones. Like he's gonna break the foundation of the banking system. Yeah, yeah. But some kind of way, he ends up dying in this movie in the streets of or uh, in San Francisco. Yeah. And then, man, and then, not too much longer, you hear about the government putting out their own form. Ooh, yeah, facts. What do you think the plot of this movie is? Some type of government conspiracy. Exactly. You yeah. see what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, the only difference. Is that you don't remove reality from this storyline. That's the same storyline. It's yeah. just you know this shit with this cash out creator is real. You know yeah. it's real life in a country that's being governed by where he died. It. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. So out of that knowing it, you gonna put a, a block of denial in front of it that's gonna make you be like, nah, I, my man taking me that the government ass. So <laughs> ain't real talk. Yeah, but I don't believe no shit like that. That means yeah. it ain't safe for me to make a billion. Real talk. That means it ain't safe for me to make a billion. Real talk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. That was a crazy. That one nothing left me scratching my head, bro. Two thirty in the morning, got stabbed up by two individuals. Okay, he wasn't saying he had no bodyguard. Ain't have nobody. How much money Troy Avenue worth? <laughs> <laughs> maybe maybe five hundred thousand million. This nigga, and he got bodyguards. And this nigga got bodyguards that's dying for him. God rest the dead, or uh, bless the dead. Um, but that don't make no sense to me. Real talk. It seemed like the creator of Cash Shop should be alive and well right now explaining to a f jury why he shot somebody who was trying to stab him or in self-defense. Facts. You see what I'm saying? Facts. Real <laughs> talk. Real talk. Real talk. I don't understand that one. It's just something to understand. It's just, it's just difficult to wrap your mind around and be okay with it. Yeah. That's the problem. Like when people hit this they know like man like, how do I function throughout daily life now knowing that this is the reality that I live in yeah and I thought I was on a playground but I'm been in a jungle yeah the most dangerous creatures that, that's been ever been created and I'm on the losing side I'm outnumbered like I don't I'm outpowered yeah you see what I mean man, how do you function and keep going with, with knowing people immediately make the decision that I can't cope with this and I don't believe it's your conspiracy theory nut no nah, you're you're a flat earther you see what I'm saying yeah they got to know how to play the game once you realize it's a game being played. Real talk. Yeah. Real talk. That's my words to tell the coach that you out there. Ooh, thanks.